Hey everybody, this is Joe. Thanks for watching the 13 October Giga Texas update video. I'd like to thank Bradford Ferguson of Halter Ferguson Financial and all of my patrons for helping to make these videos possible. Thank you. I was recently talking to one of the channel viewers, Damon, out on the site, and he was telling me that uh, very close by to Giga Texas is a 35 megawatt solar farm, and uh, he thought that, that the viewers might be interested in that. And we were talking about perhaps Giga Texas, Tesla, maybe working with Austin Energy to expand that facility or maybe bring a mega pack or do both and maybe help both the community and Giga Texas. So since uh, he thought this was a good information, I thought I would cover it for you guys. So it started in December of 2011, so it's been there for a few years. 35 megawatts, it's about 380 acres owned by the city of Austin, but about 280 acres of that are leased out for the actual solar facility. It's about one mile from Austin Energy's nearby electrical substation, and the panels are located on gimbals that uh, rotate east or west direction to track the sun, and this facility provides over 50 gigawatt uh, hours of solar power annually, and that's enough for about 5,000 homes. So maybe this is one of the reasons why Tesla chose to build Giga Texas in this particular area. As you can see by these pictures, these are uh, two aerial pictures. The one on the left is a little bit higher up. The one on the right is a little bit closer in. Again, it's about six miles as the crow flies directly to Giga, Texas. And uh, it's actually up uh, kind of in that area where Tesla bought that new land. You can get more information by the link on the bottom of the screen or in the video description. And also note that uh, this facility is open to the public. So perhaps if you're in the area, you can go out and take a look. So anyway, I hope you found that interesting. Let's go ahead and uh, get in the drone and fly and see what Giga Texas has today.